How could putting a fly in a man's urinal help keep the bathrooms clean? My name is Eric Christensen from Las Vegas Lean Six Sigma. Here's the problem. Men in the bathroom using a urinal sometimes don't aim well. Especially drunk men don't aim particularly well. However, they found if they put a sticker of a picture of a fly or some insect inside the urinal, the guys will take such aim that they will not get anything on the floor or the walls or on the guy standing next to them, which is the goal, right? That's the goal. So why would I bring this up? This is a perfect example of the Lean Six Sigma tool visual management. If we want to drive the behaviors of people, use visuals rather than a sign, please don't pee on the guy standing next to you, which wouldn't work for someone intoxicated who's not able to focus anyway. But by using visuals, we can drive behaviors, get people to do what we want them to do, and they want to do it. Make it kind of fun. Make it a game. Visuals to drive the behaviors of people. In this case, customers, but it could be for other employees. It could be where to park things, lines on the ground, uh, lines painted on walls, uh, lights, all different kinds of colors or shapes that we use to communicate status or to drive people to do or not do a particular activity. So think about your business, about where you work. Is there something happening, the equivalent of people not putting things where they're supposed to be, where there's kind of a mess or boxes around, disorganization? Is there a way to make it easy or visual so that we know where things, so that the organization has a place where everything goes so people can put things in their place and be found and recovered quickly? Could you use this to solve some problem in your organization? Please let me know your thoughts. I'd love to hear of some of the innovative ways that people have used visuals to drive the behaviors to improve the organization 